There we go. Well, <laughs> welcome. Welcome. Thank welcome you. in the studio. Thank welcome, you. Welcome. I'm happy to be here. It's exciting. So are we. And yeah. we're really excited to see what's in that little black bag. I know. Uh, I'm like, you already know. Wait. We gotta wait, we gotta wait for it, though. We gotta yeah, wait we have for to wait. it. We have to build it up. It. Yeah. Anticipation. I mean, yeah. Mouth's already watering. <laughs> I didn't want to, I didn't, you know, I don't want to, you know, overpower you guys with all the delicious uh, goodies I have. So I thought, let me just start with, you know, something real small and. Yeah, but those are small but powerful. Teaser. Mm-hmm. teaser. It's a teaser mm-hmm. into <laughs> two more. I like that's great go. business. Yeah, that's teasing. marketing yeah, right yeah. there. You see how I did that? That's teasing. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right, Dave. Why don't, why don't you start us off with uh, your life story and how you got to where you're now delivering bags of goodies. Goodies. Ah, I try not to deliver. <laughs> I, 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 ship, I ship. I, I ship, uh, ship out. Yep. Up, but yeah, I'll deliver. I mean, it's not, you know. But uh, yeah, so... Um, so honestly, you know, uh, so my background is nursing. So I'm from here in the Des Moines, um, um, well, Waterloo, Iowa. Lived here, uh, moved here when I was three, and so uh, I went to North High um, on the east side. You know, people say east side. Right. Well, po- you're a yeah, I mean, that's north side, but it all in the east I side, north, and the, yeah. So I've been, you know, we bounce around a lot. My mom bounces around a lot, so I know a lot of people from different sites of towns but so yeah so then i actually went to um then college at drake University. Hey, yeah there you go yeah drake Bull- fellow bulldog yeah, i love bulldog. it let's go <laughs> So my background, uh, so I went for nursing. There, were, I was the last graduating class mm-hmm. for the bachelor's program. Mm-hmm. And so I went Methodist School of Nursing. So I'm, I'm looking at you guys, and I'm older, definitely older than you guys. I'm like, <laughs> oh, my gosh. You know, um, yes, 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 I'm 47. So it's like, ah. Um, but so, yeah, so I went um, to nursing. And so my background is nursing. I always had, the, I've always wanted to, um, it's been in me. I'm an empath to, to even though I'm an alpha, I'm an alpha Scorpio, I'm an empath. I love to help others. And that's always mm-hmm. been within me. Um, and so my background ner- being in nursing, um, oncology, cancer, diabetic education, things like that. So, um um, and then, uh, so I did that for, you know, um, forever. I mean, I graduated in 98. I worked at, you know, um, I think every hospital maybe, but I found that, that nursing, um, oncology, I kind of got thrown into it, um, mm-hmm. because that was not what I picked in school. You know, you get to pick your, um, um, internship. Mm-hmm. So uh, oncology was not one of them. <laughs> I was like the last pick and I'm like, oh no. And then when I got on the floor the first day, I knew that God, I mean, he, that was where I was, I was, was supposed to be mm-hmm. helping. And, and you know, you know, you, you know, when you um, love what you do and you're good, um, you're, then you're good at what you do. I love to go to work every day. And so my path that led me, you know, I did in, into nursing for um, um, quite a while. And then, you know, um, I had some life events that, um, Took me out of nursing for a while, and then, um, um, and so then you know, fast forward a bit. Um, I met my husband, and um, he actually went to um, Drake as well. So he Drake Law. So he's a, a patent attorney, um, and uh, you know, so with an engineering degree. And so, um, so as far as how how the business you know um, got started when we had gotten together and. You know, um, it, it, the beginning of COVID, before we we were uh, we were due to marry, we were going to make it happen anyway, just because everything got shut down, you know, mm-hmm. yeah. and whatnot. And I was at the time, I was just kind of um, like he he said, you know, if you just don't want to work for a while, take some time off, then just why don't, why don't you do that? We're both into fitness, so CrossFit. So we CrossFit, oh, um, very, very important <laughs> to us for, um, um, you know, keep staying healthy. And mm-hmm. I'm telling you, CrossFit, people think CrossFit and they're like, ah, oh, oh my God, that, you know, CrossFit ah, is so hard and, you know, blase, blase. Well, he brought me to CrossFit. I have always worked out ever yeah. since, you know, I was a young mom. I have three boys. So I was a young mom with my oldest. Um, we literally grew up together. Like I had him at 17. And so I, he, with I dragging him by his hand, he... Um, uh, you know, was in the gym with me. And so I always had to work out. I did aerobics, mm-hmm. stab class, uh, cardio, 
kickboxing, whatnot. So, um, and then when I met James, um, I was like, he did CrossFit. Why don't you try CrossFit? I'm like, well, you don't throw a challenge at me because I'll try anything. <laughs> <laughs> Straight up, I'll try anything. Uh -oh. And people think, you challenge know, CrossFit, accepted. They, right. yeah, you know? And they, and they meet you where you're at. CrossFit meet, they, it meets you where you're at. And so what I mean by that is when you, if you go in there and you can only lift 10 pounds, then that's what you lift. Other mm -hmm. people are, are, are ahead of you and there's some behind you. And then you just kind of as you, and so that's kind of where it, um, you know, it all started. I'm like, great. I met a guy that is into his health, um, you know, um, um, his fitness and, and likes to watch what he eats. He was, he was better at that than me, carnivore <laughs> diet. So that's basically like the keto diet. Mm -hmm. so everybody knows what keto is, right? Mm -hmm. yep. No sugar, low carbs. Um, um, so, um, with that being said, then, um, you know, fast forward, COVID started at the time he had broke his, his toe from CrossFit, you know, and get scared, but doing box jumps. And, um, I'm like box jumps, you know, high, uh, high boxes, but anyway, <laughs> so he broke his toe. So now, so now we can't go to the gyms because of COVID. Okay, and he's working from home still at that time his law firm, I believe was out of Minnesota. Um. And then, um, you know, so I got this time. He was like, take some time off. He, know, he knew I was getting stressed out with my job. Take some time off. And let's, you know, well, you, you don't need to work right now. And I have a personality. He's really an introvert. I'm an extrovert. Mm -hmm. So if that's how you Yeah. I need people. I need something. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Give me something. <laughs> I don't care. I mean, I'll go down. Yeah, at the time, it, at our condo, I was like, I'll go down and just meet the mailman. Just, <laughs> yeah, like, I would go down and your day? <laughs> I would go down and push pedal and pull because we're over there by Smash Park. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Well, that's our our, uh, our other home. But with, <laughs> so at Smash Park, you know, and we're in the top level and, and so I go down and push, push pedal and pull, and I talk to, you know, the, the guys down there and talk about fitness. And I'm like, yeah, they're like, Dan, so are you bored? Or, yeah, I'm yeah. bored. Yeah. There's, no one to talk. There's no one to talk to. And my husband, I mean, like, my dog can only do so much, you know. So, you know, I, it didn't take long, let's say. It didn't take long. How it started was my husband said, and I love to cook, always been able to cook and bake, mm -hmm. and that was my thing. I got an easy bake oven at age nine. There you go. We didn't grow up with a lot of money, so I know my mom oh. had to scrape a lot of money to, uh, to together get to get mm -hmm. that. And I cherished that thing. My first thing was a brownie. I, I was like, man, this is great. And so um, my husband, you know, they always say the way to a guy's heart is through his stomach. Well, I mean, uh, then, then truly, yeah, he was like, listen, you're going to have to learn how to, uh, to, to dumb it down on your cooking because <laughs> it's so good that now I broke my, my toe. I can't really eat, you know, the, mm -hmm. um, right. you know, so my diet, I can't eat what I want because I can't work yeah, out. After yeah. I can't work out. Right. right. And so can you try to, you know, create something, you know, that's got a little less sugar and, you know, carbs and whatnot. I was like, well, yeah, absolutely. You know? And so that's, that's kind of how it, it started. It didn't start out with like, Hey, I'm going to do a, <laughs> right. make it, do a bakery. I'm going to, I'm going to start a bakery. It's, it's weird. Cause I don't know. I've always wanted to, everyone wants to work for themselves, right. don't they? At some mm -hmm. point, but mine was yeah. going to be in healthcare. Mine was going to be like a home healthcare type gig, mm -hmm. you know? And so that takes time. And I was always reading books and things on how to, and you know, it, 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 the brownies were born. That's how it the brown the was born. The brown he was like, "Honey, this is amazing, you know." And coming from your husband, like, you're like, like yeah, yeah, you go <laughs> say that. Married, right. you know, they, everything's amazing. Right. Mm -hmm. I'll wake up straight out of bed looking crazy, like I mean, I like <laughs> like a Medusa, and he'll be like, "Baby, you look good." I'm like. For real, I mean, come on now. Like, you don't have to seriously. I got hair, all you know. My my mother's white, my father's black, and you know, so I got this crazy curly. I mean, I have to tame it down, and so I'm like, okay, James, I I okay, yeah, okay, yeah, okay. So anyway, but the brownie says, really, you know. So we took some to CrossFit or CrossFit people, mm -hmm. and um. And they, uh, when I knew that they had loved them, I was like, oh, that's, that's good. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try. You know, you're bored. You're right. at home. You're stuck yeah. in the house. What can you do? Right. So I'm going to buy things I need. The, the no sugar, the, when I say no sugar, so it's a sugar substitute that mm -hmm. I used at the time. It was Swerve. And it, it doesn't raise your blood sugar alcohol levels. And so I started to create other things. Mm -hmm. And so, but here's the crazy thing. I went on Pinterest. And um, I can follow a recipe. Now, uh, I, some, most, if they're listening, will agree with me. Females today, 
and I'm not trying to put anybody down, but don't know how to cook. They don't, I mean, they, they don't know how to even read recipes. I mean, our, your generation probably, you know, <laughs> um, it's hard, it's hard, you know, when we're busy, like some mm-hmm. of us, you know, will hire a cook or some of us will, you know, do whatever, do what's easy. So I started to try some of the keto recipes on Pinterest and I know I know how to follow a recipe and those recipes weren't uh, coming out like the pictures. I'm like, hold up. I mean, come on. This is, I'm, I'm, I'm following, I'm right. doing everything right. And no, nope. I couldn't get what it looked like on the picture or the consistency. I'm like, well, this is crazy. I know how to cook. I know how to bake. Mm-hmm. I know how to, I'll create. Cause I used to make something from nothing. You know what I mean? Oh, In yeah. other words, my mom worked nights. I had three brothers and mm-hmm. I would, so I would go in with a can of, you know, I don't know, uh, canned uh, potatoes and some just some crazy stuff, whatever was in the cupboard. And I would make something from nothing. So I knew I knew how to. So I'm going to create my own recipe because um, what I learned was they get kickbacks. So if you're re- if it was a re- whole recipe right. for them. Right. You right. know, yep. you get swear. It says swerve. This is what I use for swerve sugar is underlying. Go here. You can purchase it. Uh-huh. That's how they made their money. It wasn't off of the recipe. It wasn't off of a yeah, good so recipe. To all all those out there that are trying to uh, find recipe or follow a recipe and if they don't turn out, don't believe them. Don't, don't get caught up in the hype. So, uh, yeah. And yeah. So that's what I did. I, I just, I started creating my own. I knew what, what, as long as I knew what the, um, consistency, like a cup for cup for sugar, right. you know, then I, then I could do it. And so that's when I started to create, um, more and more recipes um, and um, more and more things, and I got better at it. But I'm telling when I say a lot of sweat and tears in, in, in the kitchen, I mean, I know James is tired of hearing, you know, me cry and, you know, but as I started to create a few more recipes, and they they legit you know we're good mm-hmm. you know we don't always want i mean we like to talk about ourselves but we don't always want to you know believe that yeah you know that is good or right. i am good yep. at nursing Absolutely. or i am yep. you know and so um but li- literally what i was creating if you've ever had anything that is low carb no sugar you, it tastes like Oh, dust. Yeah. Like, oh it's my so gosh. Dry, like, gross. people, it's like, how, what, how can I believe you that this is good and this has no sugar in it? You know, honestly, you can sit here and watch me create the whole thing because it, it's hard if I was to put it in front of somebody and say, hey, not tell them. Right. Like, mm-hmm. kids. Kids. Kids yeah, don't want to hear. Don't. And juvenile diabetes is it's big. Huge. Mm-hmm. It's huge. It's big today. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And a lot of my customers are, um, you know, they have uh, either they're diabetic themselves or they have um, kids that yeah. are diabetic. Yep. yep. In, um, or celiac disease or things like that. And so, um, but yeah, that's kind of how it was born. So, I mean, so so much for me being able to kind of sit on my bottom and not do anything, yeah. you know, and enjoy that time off. Um, I just started to, to create more recipes. And finally, my husband was like, we're going to, let's just build a website. Mm-hmm. Right. It's a, you know, let's, let's, let's build a website, see how that does, start selling some things off the website and and uh, uh, and customers and and that's that's kind of how we were born. I mean, it, it's. I mean, I'm telling you, we call it God's business. Where really, we God is our foundation. Mm-hmm. I mean, um, in our marriage and in our life and and with the business. And that is, I'm telling you, it's it's just crazy how it it just hit the ground running. I love it. Yeah. So it's been it's been a fun two years. Yeah, yeah, and we're into our third year. Okay. And so, did you say fun? There's some no, fun. No, it's no, work, no. right? No, no, no. no. It, 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 <laughs> it is. is. I and I don't want anybody Passion. to get right. it wrong it's because work. things like this is fun. I right. mean, yeah. Yeah. you know, and then baking and I. Let's put it this way: My husband used to get. Oh, I'm telling you, five course meals. Guess what he gets now? Boy, you better put that in the microwave. microwave. And you know what I'm saying? You better eat it. Because you, I'm not, no. I baked all, all day, day long. You've been, you're not, you're not, uh-uh. You're not getting what you do. <laughs> and I legit feel bad about it sometimes. Because, but he doesn't, he would never, oh, it's always like, oh, it's okay. You know, it's, so I have learned to be able to manage Maybe making a, a you know a meatloaf towards the beginning right. of the week and so then have he, leftovers. He, uh, yeah, yep. yeah. He grew up with leftovers, yeah. and so yeah, he'll be fine. So absolutely, he'll be all right. He'll be yeah. all right. Oh, and he's good. He's good. <laughs> so in terms of recipes that you have and things that you offer now, mm-hmm. so do you you know do you do catering? Do you do events? Like what has kind of been your um, route currently? Okay, so that's a good question. So um, so what I do, um. 
I have. So I have, uh, well, other than making for, so you, you order from my website, obviously. I have over 80 products. I filter them in and out, like it's ah, pumpkin right. season. Yeah, yeah. Yep, pumpkin season. Oh, I, I'm so glad to see it come and go. <laughs> oh, my God. I'm so when does glad. it go, actually? Yeah, yeah. Where does it go? December? Nowhere. No. I hide all the oh, products I just on my website. <laughs> I mean, right. I said December. You know, all my recipes are up here, and I hide it. And I will every now and then. My customers know that that I'm uh, a pumpkin special. I'm, 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 I'm good. It, and, and so they'll ask, you, well, will you just please just make me these pumpkin cookies for, you know, right. even though it's not pumpkin season. Mm-hmm. And I'm such a pushover, and right. I love like, <laughs> I, I, when it. And when, when it comes to my customers, because they have been my biggest teachers. Mm-hmm. They really have. And I love, you know, I have such a, a great relationship with, with all of them, the one, the reoccurring ones. But, yeah, so... Any, anyway, so so as far as that that goes, um, me shipping all over the U.S. But I do. I've had many the Wellness Way, um, Fit Farm. Um, I've had so many people reach out to me wanting to work with me as mm-hmm. far as because Fit Farm does meals, mm-hmm. and then just getting um, you know healthy meals, right. um, the keto uh, whatever. But the, to to get the um, uh, dessert. Um, the dessert with sweets. Yeah, yeah, we gotta have sweets, but oh, yeah. they want to be healthy sweets, right. things like that. Mm-hmm. So I've had a lot of people like reach out to me, chiropractors. I think chiro- chiropractors are moving, um, you know, in a direction, a different direction these days mm-hmm. now. And so in its in eight solutions, and they are they work holistically. They do the muscle kinesiology testing. If you don't know about it, then you know, kind of read about it. It's right. pretty. It's pre- It's different. It's mm-hmm. pretty it's, cool. It's a very very crazy. Ser- experience when you first do it yeah when you first yeah. do it you're have like you, have you done it yes my have wife you? and i see it yeah oh absolutely. so that's actually so i was gonna ask so we just found out our we just had our baby and she is lactose she, okay she tested for lactose so now my wife has to cut out some dairy from her diet so oh, then yeah. our baby life. is good and different stuff. it's yeah. it's crazy how much they can find and how much so when i got covid back in december uh-huh. they started testing me and found traces a week before i actually okay. got Tested positive for COVID. COVID. It's insane. Isn't isn't it? And a lot of people don't know about it. So again, let me say it's it's, it's called muscle kinesiology. Mm-hmm. So usually, who you have um, um, doing it are um, either nutritionists or nur- nurses. Now, if you don't mind me asking, now and there's a couple. So we have. Um, um, so a good friend of ours, Izzy, her and another gal, they have over in Clyde. They, it's called Innate Solutions. Uh-huh. We do we we support them as they support us. So their um, yearly they will have their um, yearly anniversary, right. and so and they'll go crazy and buy a bunch of delicious delights, yeah. and they'll put it out on a table, you know. And um, when their customers come in, so I get customers through through yeah. them. And so then there's Nikki out in Altoona, and hers is a holistic uh, care. I believe, and I don't want to, I can't, I, I don't want to uh, crush that. So sorry, um, Nikki, when I have you listen to this. <laughs> but, um, but um, so if you don't mind me asking, where did your wife? Uh, we So we see Katie over at uh, NA Health Solutions. So you see yep. Katie. So that's the other, okay, yeah. Yep. Small world. Absolutely. <laughs> oh my goodness, stop the press. <laughs> stop okay, the press. all right. So yeah, so I was like, I was in, they're big on no sugar. Because you get the, the nutritionist. People mm-hmm. do not realize, they don't realize how bad sugar is for you. Like, you, if you, I mean, you honestly, I mean, what just, if nothing else fails, you can't figure out what's going on with you, cut then sugar. cut your sugar oh, out. Oh, yeah. I mean, seriously. Right. And this is not like a sales pitch. I'm serious. I yeah. mean, this is not like a, my product sells itself straight up. It sells itself because, um, and then di- diabetes, I'm huge on diabetic education. With our physicians today, our doctors today, uh, the most, the, the, uh, the once most trusted profession to me today is, and I'm not knocking any, any particular physician, but and is it their fault that you go in, you get 15 minutes if you eat a nap Tops. with them? Tops. So you just walk in, you're diagnosed, a newly diagnosed diabetic. Right. Okay, so huh. what do I do? Right. right. What do I do? And you're, let's say you're, you're in your 40s. Oh, my goodness, I've been eating this way my whole life. I'm not saying just sugar, but I'm saying carbs, pasta. Right. You know what I mean? Like pasta. And that right there, people don't realize that it, it cuts down, it burns, I mean, into sugar. sugar. Right. 
Okay, and there's your problem, and it, it, it is it affects, and people don't realize diabetes is a real thing, and it it it, 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 it it's if you can't learn how to it's a whole lifestyle change so just like drinking um you know people are addicted to drugs and alcohol you know you it's hard people are like well why can't you just quit well because i'm an alcoholic i can't right. just quit right. you know you wouldn't understand that if you were an alcoholic or if you don't know anybody that's an alcoholic you know um hence being I have been sober, you know, from alcohol. I mean, I couldn't, I couldn't drink well from, mm -hmm. you know, my husband has been 10, 11 years sober from alcohol. He wasn't a good drinker. When we, right. Did we know that when we got together? No. I mean, and that's, not, that's something that I'm very proud to share, that I've been sober off of alcohol, because when people think, well, I just can't quit sugar, you know, I get it, because it's just something, sugar is addicting. They put right. it in everything. Mm -hmm. You have kids that eat hot dogs. They love them hot dogs. There's sugar in hot dogs. People would never, never guess that there's sugar. There's sugar and, pop and pasta sauce. Everything that you get on the shelf at the store, there's going to be some type of sugar in mm -hmm. it, period. So. That's why I love homemaking everything. Yeah. Every, uh, do you cook? I mean, oh, I, yeah, yeah. You yeah, cook? Yeah, really? Yeah, what, what, yeah. What, what's, what's cooked for you? He's what, 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 I don't are you bake. Good? He's okay. grilling. Okay, I, don't, right. I do not bake. Okay. Yeah. Uh, because I don't like following recipes. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I, I create them. Right. <laughs> I will look go. at one and go, ooh, I like something in there, but I'm mm. changing it a lot. So absolutely. Uh, I, any anything anything outside of baking, like barbecuing, uh, yeah. Italian, Asian, it yeah. don't matter. You're, you're that good for mm. you. And you will agree with me as we're talking about this that it is a it's a it's an art. I mean it's oh, a chemistry. absolutely is an art. It's not, yeah. you know. I mean obviously if 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 if, if if everybody, everybody would do it, they, you know, right. it was that easy. Yeah, it's you know? not easy, it's but. E it's easy to us if you know right. how to do it. You know, it's like, <laughs> put a little bit of this in it, put no. a little bit of that Ooh, in That's it. a little off. Like, mm -hmm. I'll ask my wife, Michelle, all the time, like, how's that taste to you? Because I need to know yeah. how you taste things. Yeah. Because I taste things differently. Differently, absolutely. Every time. <laughs> absolutely. Every time. You guys, bag, you're shaking your heads, but you. Oh, like, I, I like to bake. Yeah, but you don't like to cook. No, I like to cook, too. <laughs> okay. But I, I. I I think I'm more the baker. My wife is probably more the chef. Is she? Oh, yeah. <laughs> but we, but we, we love a, a good meal. And I think it's like the, the prep of building it together. Yeah. It's also really cool. Uh, yeah. And then eating it and then it's having bonding. something good at the end. But I've done, I've done like 30 days where I haven't had sugar. And yeah. it's really Absolutely. hard not to find, like, you have every label has sugar. So Doesn't you're like, what it? am I going to eat? What right. am I going to eat? Yeah. And it, so it's always number it one or two. It has to be, it, yeah, it's always number one or number two and it's challenging. So I had a health challenge and that was a big thing. I had to change my eating after that, my sure. doctor. So we, we did a couple of those like 30 days and I could feel it. Whenever I brought sugar back yeah. in, I could feel it. Awful. Tell, tell and it. I'm you like, can feel it. Oh, yeah. yeah, you're welcome back. Yeah. I'm That's like, it. I don't like this feeling. <laughs> Isn't it but you can how eat, you can eat. Yeah, I could totally tell the difference. So. It, it, yeah, it is. It's it's so it's crazy, and people and you can tell if you're sluggish or if you're. Yeah, I mean, you know, girl. I mean, yeah. And what about your wife? Is your wife? Does she? I mean, well, she's a physical therapist, so she we're both into like health and working out, same kind of thing. But awesome. yeah, we, so we try to do that together because whenever it's one of us, like one of us step is back, be, yeah. and then they bring in <laughs> something in the house, it's like really hard not. Right. It, it really it's is. It's like so tempting. Well, not to mention what they get. At, so our wives work together. <laughs> okay. Uh, oh, and okay. the amount of treats they get at that at oh, work yeah. is ridiculous. <laughs> like, so like, we're going to ah. we're gonna introduce them because they yes. bring some <laughs> Yeah. We'll just bring them because. Yeah. So, so, okay. So physical <laughs> therapy. And you already know too. So being, uh, being a nurse, you know, man. So if you're at, if you're ever trying, if I'm ever trying to get business, all you got to do is hit every hospital in Des Moines <laughs> because you go up on the floor and every nurse is eating. That's we love yeah. to eat. We yeah. put it in, in the break room, physical therapist, yeah. whatever. Yeah. You put it in the break room. Uh, Man, I just look at I just walk right past There's your a break room over there. There's yep. cookies over there. There's Already all cookies. kinds of yeah, stuff. Absolutely. I was almost tempting as I was <laughs> getting my coffee here. I was like, it, because it is. I mean, I'm not going right. to say that I completely, you know, cut sugar out of my diet. Now, um, I you, because it's easy to 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 just right. pick right. up and go, mm -hmm. you know. So you don't keep it in the house. Is is, right. is oh that. yeah, Absolutely. that's yeah. the easiest Absolutely. thing. Uh -huh. um, as we get to towards the end of our time, and I'm going to assume our guests are going to want to have you back for a full <laughs> hour, hour and a half. Yeah, sesh. yeah, um, yeah. I I forgot. What, what are things <laughs> that in in your business where you're at? Yeah. What do you need help with? Where where are you in regards to wanting to take that next step with your business, or are you just comfortable living life? 
No, 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 no. You're always, listen, I work hard. My husband and I both work hard on our mm-hmm. business. Um, and again, like I said, so a lot of sweat and tears, right? Mm-hmm. At the beginning. And um, no, so if you're comfortable, you're not growing. So I, I didn't set out to do this for no no reason. I mean, I, it, the way it, it happened, it happened. But now that I it's successful, it's and it's getting more successful every day. But so now we need to, to, to grow, get into um, a, a bigger... Uh, um, uh, like like the high bees um, to, to to manufacture on a higher level. I'm only one person. Mm-hmm. I've hired on you know a couple people now, and so to grow um, to even get the, the the word out there even more. So you know through social media, we hired on some marketing, mm-hmm. doing some you know TikToks, different things like right. that. So yes, obviously, because it's <laughs> well, either TikToks. you know I know I'm not I can't cuss and all that on oh, here, but you either crap can. or get, just it, not the f bomb. No no kay. no crap or get off. The <laughs> you, know, <laughs> yeah, you know what I mean? Here we go. No, Oh, it's a godly woman. I don't ever want to. Right, right. Crap, get off. Crap, get off. You know what I mean. Absolutely. And my husband loves being an attorney. Right. He doesn't want to. I mean, you know, he would like to see. We we put a lot of sweat and tears mm-hmm. in when you guys when you start a business. It's not all that it's cracked up to be. I mean, it, you everybody gets to see the other part of it. Like, oh, these are good. These are great. But they don't get to see behind the scenes. It's like Period. the Pinterest pictures. They're pretty, yeah. but that recipe not good. I know that's right. I know <laughs> that's we, right. we say this a lot about um, to our uh, business clients and just in general is uh, being a business owner sucks, but mm-hmm. you have to embrace that suck. Too. Absolutely, absolutely. Embrace the struggle. Yeah, embrace absolutely. the struggle. My husband has a book. So when he got sober, you know, he wrote a book about embracing the struggle because he could not. He thought he was going to die before he got sober, you know. And mm-hmm. then just lifelong, you know. Yeah. But it, yes. Yeah, so we it, we either gr- grow. So now, so now everything is inflation is crazy, right? Mm-hmm. So getting into so we have. Our, our townhome or our um, condo where we had started out in this little kitchen, big old uh, in condo, we kept it and moved it into a bigger home. Kitchen's way bigger, but now, you know, you got to buy by code More and everything so, right. like that, of mm-hmm. course. But then now we're growing. We were going to do a barn dominium. Okay, so everything is more expensive. <clears throat> so we have uh, contractors in and out now. We were thinking about growing out um, for now. Um, yeah. Our, you know, so we're to to, to get a place because I'm not paying three thousand dollars for a storefront. Um, you know, um, we might as well get our own store. Right. Right. Or pay somebody three thousand dollars a month, month is what I'm saying. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You'd rather you know own I mean? it. So that's where we yeah. Were, yeah, yeah, because that's what our my customers want to see now. People want to see. They want to come, come in. They yeah. want to pick out mm-hmm. a single. You know, cupcake, right. a single, instead of having to, you know, order a half a dozen or a dozen. Yeah. You know, mm-hmm. and inflation, I, you know, I don't know what y'all's grocery bills look <laughs> like, but ours, I mean, it's yeah. It's up there. So that's where we just want to, yeah. you know, obviously grow, um, and get, get our name out there more. And, and we've done, thank you, Lord, we've done very well so far, thus far. It's been, uh, honestly, it's been a blessing almost to, uh, to, uh, uh, much to believe to, to mm-hmm. be able to tell somebody else or like you're lying and that and that amount of you you know in two years because that's when when businesses start out right they're like that's you know they barely make you know in two years you know you're you're hitting over a uh, six figure um yeah. and what the business is you know, doing is is, uh-huh. is a blessing from from god so. i love it i love it it's amazing oh so, yeah so well, hey yeah hit her it's all I'm saying. Delicious on. delight. Yep. Delicious and gonna, we'll, delights. We'll, 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 we'll blast it on um, <laughs> uh, our socials as well and YouTube, and I'm sure we're going to have her back as well. <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah, would love to be here. But reach out, order some. Yep, order Delicious some. Delights. And it's low carb, no sugar um, desserts. And so, uh, yeah, and everything's under five or less carbs. I do cakes, I do everything. And the, the, the main thing you, y'all need to know is that it is. Same great taste. You just want a sample. You don't want to spend the money. I, I got you. Well, I got all right. You. Well, let's, let's, let's do that. that. <laughs> Come on. Yeah. Okay. What'd you bring us? Um, so what I did bring you, these are turtle cheesecake cups and what oh, they gosh. are. So they're little. Um, so what they are filled with a uh, cheesecake and um, homemade caramel. Okay. With uh, uh, chocolate. So they look like peanut butter cups, but they're uh, turtle cheesecake. So they got the cheesecake in the middle and caramel. And then they're, uh, of course, it's all covered in chocolate with pecans on top oh and it's gosh. got three grams of carbs in each one and no sugar oh well, let's go ahead yep there you go yes and so you have to peel the obviously peel the do it on camera now, right I brought in front of oh absolutely the, <laughs> yeah man you guys and don't you don't know by if, if we're still on air they'll know oh, yeah. you have to uh 
you you have to. Uh, yeah, man, you're like, oh no right. way. Make a mess. Yeah, that's okay. You're <laughs> make a mess. Say R O, honey. And they came out the freezer, so I had made them just uh, the oh, day yeah. before yesterday. <laughs> And so with they everything all my things have, have have been ketone tested so ketone so the keto coach and then diabetic uh, uh, testing so yeah <laughs> it's melting your mouth Carmel hey, mm-hmm. good huh oh yeah yeah make sure yeah may, maybe your wife can get one are you sure there's no sugar I can bring more I'm about I know <laughs> people say that exactly and I'm like here come on I'll show you exactly what I use for my sugar substitutes I wholesale everything out now. It's kind of nice, except for my dairy. Um, that's been hard to do. You said, do you know three, that, you said three carbs? Yeah. Yeah. Mm, and actually, so I'm a is, high protein, low carb guy. I'm yeah. about to eat Are you? 12 of those. Listen, so that's actually for this um, because of it, that, that's actually a lot of carbs for, 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 for these little, little ones. Yeah. yeah, but I my cookies like that. Yeah, so you're, mm. we're looking at three, three, three. I mean, full carbs. disclosure, I do not like cheesecake. So no, eating yeah. that, like, yeah. that's. Yeah. I don't get any cheesecake flavor. Like me, for I don't really. I don't no. know. It's there, but it's like the, oh. the sour, almost bitterness of cheesecake. I'm not a big fan of. Right, yep. right. But, but the, I'm a sucker for caramel. So, oh yeah, <laughs> I mean, yeah. I'll, I'll take that. Order and these. I, and I, uh, yeah, there get you go. all of these. Order yeah, all yeah, of yeah, these. Yeah, absolutely. I have over 80 <laughs> products. It. It's hard. I tell my cousin what's easy to do is um. So what I have called, what's called sampleicious platter. So if you don't know, you know, you just pick. Uh, you give it three in the yeah. delicious platter. Absolutely. Well, yeah. we appreciate you. Absolutely. Uh, well, next time. Thank you so thanks much. Thanks for having me. This guys. was fun. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks for having me. The preceding program was sponsored by Black Mammoth. Any awards, rankings, or recognition by unaffiliated third parties or publications are in no way indicative of the advisor's future performance or any individual client's investment success. No award, ranking, or recognition should be construed as a current or past endorsement of Black Mammoth. Information regarding specific awards, rankings, or recognitions is available on the Black Mammoth website, www.blackmammoth.com. All investment strategies have the potential for profit or loss. Investment strategies such as asset allocation, diversification, or rebalancing do not assure or guarantee better performance and cannot eliminate the risk of investment losses. There are no guarantees that a portfolio employing these or any other strategy will outperform a portfolio that does not engage in such strategies. This broadcast should not be construed by any client or prospective client as a solicitation to affect or attempt to affect transactions and securities or the rendering of personalized investment advice due to various factors, including changing market conditions. The information discussed in this broadcast may no longer be reflective of current positions or recommendations. While information presented is believed to be factual and up-to-date, Black Mammoth do not guarantee its accuracy and it should not be regarded as a complete analysis of the subjects discussed. The tax and the state planning information discussed is general in nature and is provided for informational purposes only and should not be construed as legal or tax advice. Listeners should consult an attorney or tax professional regarding their specific legal or tax situation. Past performance is not indicative of future results.